Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back. I've been a little sick, that's why I haven't posted any videos lately, but that's no excuse. This channel must go on. So, today I got asked a great question. The one that I get asked, mm, I would say two, three times a week. And by the way, big shout out to Caesar Corrales for this question. So, what should I eat to lose weight? which is the title of the video. Now the reason why people ask this question is because they're misinformed or they don't know the information. You know, that's why you watch videos like this to, to inform yourself, right? So it has nothing to do with what you eat. So don't expect me to say, oh, I eat tilapia, brown rice, chicken breast, and egg whites. You know, that's, no, I don't eat, I don't only eat that. I eat pretty much everything. How you lose weight or how you increase weight, you gotta track your macros. So, and I made a video on how to track your macros, and I will link that in the description below. It'll be the first link. Um, just click on that, it'll take you right to that video. So, <clears throat> it has nothing to do with only eat salads, only eat chicken breast, only uh, whole grains, you know. It has nothing to do with that, guys. I can get skinny off eating junk food but I prefer not to because it's not nutritious for my body, okay? Now, that's why you see like other videos of, of guys that are ripped and they're, you know, eating junk food or food that's probably not beneficial, you know, for their physique. They stay under a caloric deficit and they track their macros so that they're able to eat that, you know, whatever that meal is. So, hopefully that makes sense. So it's not what you eat because I can I can eat let's say 10 salads a day and gain weight you know get fat because it would put me over my caloric intake which basically puts me over my macros because if you're tracking calories you're tracking macros you know they go hand in hand you know I can get fat or I can get skinny off of junk food and I can get fat off of healthy foods quote unquote, right? I can eat salads all day, I can eat chicken breast all day, I can eat tilapia, I can eat brown rice, I can eat, you know, potatoes, I can eat turkey, and still gain weight. So it has nothing to do with what you eat, but the amount of what you eat. So meaning the caloric intake and what it's made of, which is the macros, how you break it down. Hopefully that you understand that, and in the next video I'm gonna make a video of what foods I prefer to eat when I'm in a caloric deficit um, and I'll make it specific to those who like to eat a lot so you can eat voluminous foods so you don't have to eat little to fill up those macros or for those of you who like to eat little and uh, you know get your macros that way it's just personal preference you know if you're used to eating a lot if you're not used to eating a lot if you like to eat a lot or if you don't for example I can have a salad, you know, pretty good size that has 210 calories, or I can have two cookies that equal to 210 calories. Obviously, the salad is a lot more voluminous than the two cookies. So, I mean, it kind of depends on what you would rather eat to fill up those macros, but you know, that's up to you personally. But to answer your question, it's not what you eat, it's how much you eat of it. And basically track your macros and that's how you lose weight. That's how you get cut. You know? Mm. That's how you get them striations. So that's it for this video guys. Thanks for tuning in so much. If you enjoyed this video or found it beneficial, give it a big thumbs up. Well that was two. No one. No one. If you give it two, that'd be awesome, but you can't. You can only click on it once. So we'll give it one thumbs up. And <laughs> but as always, guys, stay fitted. Stick with it. And I'll see you guys in the next one.